Hey Caleb, thanks for taking the time to watch this. So what I'm going to do is go over three things that you can do to your website that's going to help bring in customers. I'm also going to just take a look at what your competition's doing here and show you what you can do to, to beat them out. Uh, first off, I like your website. It looks like you do great work, so that's always a plus. Um, the, the main thing that I, I really want to point out here is your website's not secure. This is real easy to fix. You can actually go to your registrar, the people you bought the website domain name from, and get an SSL. Uh, this will secure the website and this will help you rank. Google does not want anybody to be found that doesn't have a secure website, so it'll be very difficult uh, to rank. And I'll show you here in a few minutes why that, that matters. Okay, so the three things we're gonna touch on is content, citations, and backlinks. So those are the three things that you really need to rank a website to get it to come up and to bring customers in naturally, organically, so you don't have to pay Angie's List um, monthly forever, right? So overall, your site looks good. I will say uh, content's a big thing, right? So you need about 1,500 words or so to be able to rank generally. I would say uh, based on what your competition's doing, you could probably get away with less and still be um, good but generally 1500 is right around the, the minimum that Google's looking for and the reason for that is they're going through your website crawling it and reading all the content to see what the website's about once Google knows what the website's about it's easy to find people in the services that people are searching for especially if you have the right keywords in your content and all that means is like the phrases people are searching for so I looked up general contractor in Norfolk and there's a hundred searches for this monthly so every month you got a hundred guys searching for a general contractor I know you do remodeling um, but there are a whole bunch of different ways people could end up at your site so if you think about that I mean you're talking hundreds of customers thousands of customers that are trying to find you of course there's a, a, a ratio here so you got 100 people searching for this number or searching for this particular phrase about 80 percent go to the map pack and then beyond that the rest of those mostly end up in the top three people that uh, are top three searches here so how do you get in this map pack well for one you set up a google business page that is free if you do it yourself uh, if you don't have one make sure you get it it's a a big business driver Make sure you fill it out all the way and that'll help you a ton. The number one thing to get ranked higher in here is actually citations and not the ranking here. So what's a citation? A citation is the name, address, phone number, and website being listed in a directory. A directory is something like Angie's List, Yellow Pages, White Pages, and there are, there are thousands of directories online. You wanna have more than your competition. You wanna have substantially more than your competition and that will help drive you up higher in this rating here or in this list which is called the map pack the second highest thing to rank here in the map pack is to actually rank organically so ranking organically is two birds with one stone kind of thing you're going to be able to move up in this list as well so how do you rank organically again it's content but the second thing is backlinks so taking a look at these guys here they don't have a lot of backlinks I'll, I'll go into that here in just a second but it's um it's important to note that they're not actual companies right so this is just angie's list house and better business bureau you can outrank these guys with your website because you have you can add more content more backlinks in them and you will be above them so it's definitely doable i did pull up the uh, map pack here to see if you came up I couldn't find you in here um, so I, I hope you have one and it just needs to be optimized if you don't have one you should definitely get on that pulled up one of your competition here they're also not secure so I have a little bit more content but not really definitely beatable is is a point here uh, there's a lot of money being left on the table for you and I, I really hope uh, that you're you you do these few things and it'll help you tremendously so i noticed i found you on angie's list um there this is this is decent but you have to share your leads with the top people right so you got 
these other folks in here that are also getting the, the, the leads. Whereas if you own the website and you're on the top, you will be driving your own business and getting your own um, customers without having to pay money for the rest of your life. So um, just to kind of recap, make sure you get your secure site fixed. That's like a 20 minute thing you could do. Um, content, citations, and backlinks. Uh, backlinks. So what's a backlink? Backlink is a link from one website to another. So you think like uh, Facebook, how someone can link something to a, another web page. That is one link. And the referring domain would be Facebook. So the more links you have, the more popular your site is in Google's eyes, which will increase these numbers here, which will help your content be found. So the higher the numbers, the more content that's found, which is these keywords, which will drive more traffic to your site. Not all backlinks are the same. You have a backlink from a new site. It's going to carry a lot more weight than if you have um, somebody's blog that nobody visits. So just kind of skipped one there for a minute. Hope, hope you don't mind. Uh, let me know what you think. Uh, love to hear from you soon. Thanks.